everybody. Pringles here. We are at the Jelly Belly factory in Fairfield. Yum, 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 yum. Yummy, yummy. We're going to go take a tour. Self-guided tour. So Self -guided tour. we're going on a tour. And we're going to ride the Jelly Belly train. We hope. We hope. We'll see. But um, it looks pretty cool. We're excited. Yay. So at the entrance, they still have their Christmas tree up. Um, we're here first week of January, but there's the Jelly Belly sign. Tours and gifts. Aaron is consumed with his Pokemon game right now because there are so many Pokemon and he's getting pictures. But babe, didn't you find like a Pokemon Volkswagen and like all this fun stuff? So we're gonna, oh, oh I wanna get this Jelly Belly car over here. Um, and then we're gonna go in and pay our fee. It's $7 for anybody who's interested to come and do the tour and it includes riding the train. We're gonna grab a bite to eat at the cafe, so we'll catch you guys on the inside. Okay, we're gonna catch walking in because it actually, from the very beginning, looks amazing. So, ooh, oh my gosh, who's that, you guys? Who's that? We know. Oh my gosh, is this amazing? Chocolate shop. There is like a chocolate and wine tasting tour. Ooh, there's more. Wait, the glare. You can't hardly see. Oh my goodness. Aw, rest in peace, buddy. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. So here's a quick view. We gotta find the bathroom, but we'll go into detail with you guys. This is the cafeteria. We're here at the end of the day. It took us longer to get here. We kind of got lost. So um, unfortunately, we're here towards the end of the day, but we're still gonna try to get in the tour and the train. Um, that's the... California Welcome Center, Fairfield, um, little area. Tons of brochures and stuff, but pretty huge cafeteria. Ooh, let's see what this is. Okay, so you, <laughs> of course, a jukebox with jelly bellies. Oh, 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 it's closed, but jelly belly ice cream. Oh no, it's just regular ice cream, but I was hoping it was Jelly Belly flavored ice cream. Fun. Case load sale. They have a kid's menu. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Kids cheeseburger, kids hamburger, kids hot dog, corn dog, chicken nuggets, grilled cheese sandwich, chicken strips, nine fifty. Tons of stuff. I know you can't really see. There we go. So that's the cafeteria. We're gonna grab a bite to eat actually. And then um catch they even have outdoor seating. Oh, so cute. Okay, we just paid for our tours. Aaron's, I think, are you pulling up a scavenger hunt, babe? Mm -hmm. Okay, and so now fancy dancy little stairs to join the tour um yeah it was 14 dollars for both of us that includes entrance into the museum the museum doesn't close until five this tour is over with at four. Oh, look at down here you guys that's i think the chocolate yeah the chocolate shop duh right there also my blind eyes i didn't see that the um cafe was closed when we walked up so we didn't eat there but we'll, we'll get food somewhere. Okay. Look at Margo! <laughs> it looks Look. like... Liam, we can't go down that way. It looks like you can do like this, you know, the little portraits. Put yourself in the picture. That's cute. But we'll take our own. We're starting the tour. He came up with dance full names. I mean, most importantly, he named them Jelly Belly Jelly Beans. We purchased some Jelly Belly Cake from David Klein and Cal. We just had our picture taken with this, with this boy here. And now we are officially on a self-guided 
walking tour of the Jelly Belly factory. So obviously I don't think it's in, um, like everybody's gone home. Well, there's a few workers in there, but this is where the Jelly Bellies are made. Honey, I think um, we can go through here and get closer. Oh, gotcha, okay. Pretty cool. It's pretty loud. Just a forewarning. Like, if any of you are sound sensitive or if you have autistic children that you're bringing, you're going to want to bring headphones so that they don't get overwhelmed. Because, um, as you can hear, if you can even hear me when I listen back to this, it's pretty darn loud. And there's lots of honking, like with forklifts and stuff. So that's just a forewarning that I have for mamas and daddies. I forget how many days they said it takes to make one jelly belly, but it's quite a few. Okay, we can come up closer now. Boxes and boxes of, yeah, there's still tons of people working. I mean, it's only like 3.30, so it makes sense. I don't know what all that stuff covered up over there is. But there we are. I was taking pictures of each, each of the years, but then I was like, oh my gosh, that's gonna be. Yes, I'm from California. I say like. I was like, all right? Um, I was like, that's gonna be a lot of pictures. So they have it pulled up all the way to um, 2016, 40th anniversary of the Jelly Belly. Jelly bean. So, babe, you did the um, scavenger hunt. Yeah. Is that part of it right here? Oh, yeah. So, Aaron is doing the free scavenger hunt that comes with it. And can you tell us a little bit about it, baby? I don't know. I mean, this okay. is the third stop. Oh, this um, is the third stop. Okay. And I think you can win prizes. So, let's take a look at your phone here. He's entering the code. So, there's a QR code on your ticket when you get it. They give you this QR code to start your scavenger hunt. And so he's doing that while I'm filming. Very cherry lane. That's kind of cute, huh? More of the factory. Pretty cool. Look at those presses over there. I don't know what they're pressing. I'm curious. I wish I could go in there. What do you think they're pressing right there? Like, yeah, let me go in. Let's go over here. Oh, and of course, it stops right when I zoom in. Oh, here it goes. Oh, you know what? I think it's the... Oh, you know what it is, Aaron? You know when you open a Jelly Belly thing, it has all the list of the Jelly Belly? Yeah, okay. So, it's the... That's what they're doing. They're, they're printing that. It's like a box top or something. You know? Anyways. This is a lot of history here, which I won't, I will not read all of this to you guys. We might stop the filming and come back because it is fascinating to us. Um, but that would make for a very long vlog. So it'll just inspire you if you are a history buff and you like Jelly Bellies, then you can come, come to the Jelly Belly factory. Take a trip to Fairfield. We're coming up to some pretty fascinating art. So let me get that and then I'm going to, um, oh wow, they did Ronald Reagan, Statue of Liberty, George Washington, Abe Lincoln. We've got someone in there, so. Okay. I'm gonna head back. So we're discovering Ronald Reagan really loved his jelly bellies. His favorite flavor was the black, black licorice. licorice. Which is mine. Um, my favorite. He sent jelly bellies to space in, I think, 1983. We're not claiming to be Republican or Democrat or Green Party or anything. We're just telling you facts here. Let go, Cowboy Ronnie. Let go, Cowboy Ronnie. Yeah. He sent um, jelly bellies into space. And we think that that's really cool. So I'm going to turn this around and show the pictures here that we see of him with black jelly bellies. So that's pretty cute. That's what we discovered in our <laughs> reading of all of the history. Up there. 
Joe Montana. Oh my gosh. So here's some action for you guys. We, we came, we walked farther down. Now here's more artwork. Let me see if I can zoom in. So we've got what, baby? We got the Jelly Belly guy. A hundred years? Have they hit a hundred years? Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, Jelly Belly. Um, Joe Montana. Giant Elvis. 89 World Series. I can't. Oh my gosh, Princess Diana. I said Elvis, but Amelia Earhart, another Elvis, and then I can't. We're gonna go around to the other side. We gotta get five people. I don't know who the last two. Who's this one, baby? No, no, not not that one. This one, the one next to the left of Elvis. I don't know who that is. Um, and then the la and then the very last one is Spider Man and Jelly Belly Art. Jelly Bean Art. Don't make me feel dumb if I don't does anybody know who that is? Tell us, please. Don't make me feel dumb. Who is that, babe? We don't know. We don't know. So tell us if Johnny Carson. Oh my gosh, Johnny Carson. Wow. Okay. And that's the Giants and A's World Series, 89 World Series, which is right around the big earthquake. Right? When that's was the big earthquake? Yeah. The Loma Prieta earthquake. Damn, that, that earthquake was nuts. I mean, the bridges were falling down on top of cars. Oh, God, how scary. I don't want to think about it. Um, but here they are in action. Here they are in action. Oh my gosh, there's more artwork, babe. Oh, Donald Duck, our favorite. Our absolute favorite. My favorite. So we've got Aunt Bully. Oh, Donald Duck. I'm drawing a total blank, but too funny. What? Oh. Laurel and Hardy. Yeah, Laurel and Hardy, you guys. Ah, oh, James Dean, Elvis again. I guess they really loved Elvis. Um, the Eagle. Babe, what general is this? Um, Jimmy. Jimmy Doolittle. Air and Space Museum. Reaching for the stars. I'm sure that some of you, I should know. My dad is a Vietnam vet. But I didn't. And this is um, Ronald Reagan again. The Pope! Oh my gosh! Wow. And Bush. George Bush. Oh my gosh, more of... There's another A. Lincoln here. It looks like he's got like... Uh, um... Oh, look at all the dyes, babe. Can you see? Wow. Makes me, I would love to read the ingredients on those dyes. I'm sure you could just read the ingredients on a Jelly Belly package. But that's, oh, CNH sugar. Look at all that CNH sugar. Holy cow, that's crazy. And do you think this is just a huge refrigerator? Or what do you think that is? Oh, is that a smell station? Uh, Sorry, yes. kids. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is all Jelly Bellies here. Wow. Okay, let's take a guess. What do you say this first row is? I mean, there's like a raspberry maybe? I don't even know if they're, uh, oh, the, they haven't been dipped in their coating oh, yet. Oh, they haven't been dipped in their coating yet, so we can't tell. But one of these is probably popcorn. There's somebody working their little tail off to make us some candy. That oh. is moving. He is moving. He's like going like, oh wait, we gotta get the smell station. Okay, so here's a smell station. We're gonna smell it. You smell it first, honey, so I can get your reaction. What's it supposed to smell like? America's favorite jelly belly flavor, maybe? Which would be wrong. Oh, very, very cherry. cherry. So smell it. I don't think you were supposed to look first, but oh well. Yeah, I didn't know. But, yeah. but does it? Yeah, oh yeah. Okay. Here's a pretty fascinating part of the factory. Um, see the big, I'll come over here and then I'll zoom in. But the big, I don't even know what to call them, but there's tons of jelly bellies in there and it just spins them. I don't, 
Okay, he's got a scavenger hunt thing. He's got a, we're, we're having so much fun. But there's also a machine up here. Okay, you can see it working right now. It's picking up, let me see, let me zoom in. It's picking something up. It reminds me of the new little drink making crane or whatever you want to call it, robot on Royal Caribbean cruise ships. But it reminds me of, they just made a miniature of it. We're playing this game. Okay, second half. Hey, I won the first half. Now I'm filming, I'll probably lose. Let's see how it goes. See, I can't see, I'm, I'm, yeah. Oh, I'm actually, oh wait, never mind. That's not scores against each other. That's saves oh, and goals. <laughs> We're working as a team. Oh wow, what's the, what's, what'd we get? What'd we do? We're not on there. We're not on there. What the heck? That's weird. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so now we're at the molds. So this is the candy corn. Can you guys see how hard? I'm not sure how to do this here. The candy corn mold. But wouldn't that make it hollow? I'm so confused. Um, oh, okay. This is the bottom of it. So you turn it over and you put the candy inside of the other side. Um, sour bunnies, same thing. You would turn this mold over and fill it. Mellow cream Halloween. Oh my gosh. So this is one of my favorite candies on the planet. I eat too many when they come out. Mellow cream Santas, raspberries and blackberries, another awesome candy. Um, ooh, sun-kissed fruit gems. I never see these anymore. They're so good. Wiggle worms. Well, you guys know. Sour worms or whatever the heck they are. Um, let us show you more. Each kettle holds 400 pounds of slurry. Building a bean. How cute. Two, slurry is made of sugar, water, corn syrup, and corn starch. You guys can finish reading that. Flavor. Awesome. 50 tons of slurry per day. That's as much as 16 elephants. Holy, that's a lot of sugar. Oh, and more molds. Mold impressions with liquid candy slurry. Woo, weird. That's kind of weird. I don't know. I don't know about all that. The gummy one's missing. Jelly Belly Fish, which is a chewy candy. Oh, the rat! Gummy pet rats! Ha <laughs> Yeah, can't tell you what kind of it is. Gotta get it down. It's banana? Oh, it's so loud right here. This is pretty cool. I feel like I'm watching, I don't know. <laughs> the Jurassic Park movie or something. I don't know. There's a movie that this reminds me of. I can't think of it right now. But... And it's got a massive U.S. flag hanging. We think that all of the jelly beans that you guys just saw coming off of the conveyor belt, we've decided that it is top banana. So here's the 50 flavors. Over 50 fun flavors. What's your favorite? Mine is black licorice. Tell us below. What's your favorite? Plum and pomegranate. And yours is what, honey? Plum or pomegranate. Plum or pomegranate. And we're going to see a couple of friends whose favorites are blueberry, marshmallow, or popcorn. Toasted marshmallow or popcorn. Buttered popcorn. Buttered popcorn. So we're going to grab some of, some of everybody's favorites. And it says, thanks for visiting! Yay! Okay, after we left the tour, we see the belly flop signs, which Aaron and I agree we are going to definitely get some of those. We used to buy these like they were going out of style. Belly flop. All 
of the uniforms. They have flags on them. I think you can see from up there, but it's like, oh, oh my gosh, Jelly Belly uniforms. A little more artwork we have to show you guys because this is so cool. And then we'll stop bugging you with our Jelly Belly madness. <laughs> Literally two kids in a candy store, right babe? Better than the store, it's the factory. <laughs> Better than the store, it's the factory. And our Kringly Kringle. Aww, let it go, let it go. I don't want to though. I don't want to leave. Look at the dragon, John Wayne. <gasps> This is what I need next to my bed. A Jelly Belly, a black licorice Jelly Belly dispenser. <laughs> we totally forgot about the store. We have to show you guys the store. So we're gonna do a quick little, um, they close at five and, and we wanted to be able to go check out the museum. So we're kind of doing this a little bit quick and I apologize, but belly flops that we were just talking about Buy three bags, get two free, $12 per two pound bag. That's actually an excellent deal. We just found um, a sweatshirt that we really like. It's on sale for $16. Obviously we're not getting a small, but I'm just showing you guys what the sweater is. The Bean Boozled, Sriracha, Jalapeno, Cayenne, and Habanero, and Carolina Reaper. I can't even imagine biting into a Carolina Reaper bean. Oh gosh, I mean, I love hot sauce, don't get me wrong. But I don't know about the Carolina Reaper. The Outlaw, yeah, yeah. Okay, and then they've got like some, oh, coffee mugs. I do love coffee mugs. Um, umbrellas, hats, ooh, cocktail classics. Stock up on that. Some bags, Jelly Belly flip flops, socks, all kinds of fun stuff, okay? So come visit the Jelly Belly factory. I see a lot of shirts. Hi. Okay. Do you mind if I film? Say what's up. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. So we're starting the museum tour. And again, we're not going to read everything to you guys, but we just want to inspire where you where yeah where they started where they moved which coincides with what we filmed earlier the factory workers okay but wow let's see if I can pronounce this word this octogenarian refuses to quit after 59 years as a candy salesman I mean candy's awesome who agrees look at this babe Aaron this is like the biggest Witch's brew pot. Fun. Yeah, right? Look at these old machines. Oh my gosh. Oh. We actually have, we have what? Like a 1940s blender, babe? Yeah. And then we have a 1930s or 40s um, nut grinder. Yes. Nut the fruit. <laughs> okay, anyways. <laughs> this is a family-friendly channel. Um, okay. Cincinnati, go Bengals. Cincinnati, go Bengals. And, you know, prayers for our our boy Hillman. that went down on the field. Well, it was the Bills boy, but he's everybody's boy. He Hillman. needs... Yeah. That was scary. That was scary. How he went down. Anyways, I don't want to get into it, but that was scary. All More art, more art. Look at that. That is just fascinating. They have to coordinate all the colors. Loads more history here, you guys, to come check out. There's jelly bellies all over. Some of the machines that we get to check out will go around the other side. Um, Portland. Wow, Portland, honey. I didn't I didn't see Portland factory pictures in inside. Oh, you did? Okay. I must have missed that. There's our old jelly belly friend in his wagon. Did you get your, um... No, there's one or two I missed over there, so... Oh, okay. Got gotcha, you, got gotcha. you. That's kind of how I felt on the Star Cruiser. Like, I could not get... I could not... I need to go again. 
because you're kind of on a scavenger hunt, to be honest. It's totally interactive. And I was on the dark side, which was super fun, but I just could not get all my stuff done. Look at this, old conveyor belts. Aaron's going with me on the Star Cruiser next time because he's very good at those kinds of things. I was trying to impress him and come home having like one. <laughs> I was, babe. Or, what are you saying awe about? Thanks for trying. Oh, I was. I was trying. But I failed. Oakland, California. Oakland. Damn, that's some rough times. Those boys. I can remember, I'm going to tell you guys a little story. When I was a little kid, this doesn't have anything to do with Oakland. This has to do with LA. But in the 80s, when cocaine was insane, it probably still is, but my dad had taken us to LA to visit my older sister who was living there. And my grandma was with us, my little old Italian grandma who, you know, goes to mass every Sunday, 80 years old, was still kneeling on the pews, says like hundreds of Hail Marys a day. Anyways, we're driving along, she's in the front seat, and this car in front of us throws out, no, this car speeds in front of us and throws out this huge bag of cocaine. The bag of cocaine like flies all over our car, all over our tires, everything. My dad's like, what the? And um, all of a sudden, another car, oh, I missed this part. Another car comes speeding by us and they were chasing the car that dumped out the cocaine. And we were like caught in the middle of this madness. And my grandma, my poor little grandma, she's like, Frankie, what's going on? So it was, it was pretty weird. That's my story about cocaine. Chocolate melter. Ball cream beer. <laughs> okay. Anyways, like we said. <laughs> we are not laughing at that. We just talked about cocaine. Now, how can we... Okay. I'm going to put a little sanitary mixer. Blend plus mixer. Kind of cool, you guys. Kind of cool. Vertical cutter. Dissolve. Her cooker. Pretty cool. I wonder how much it would weigh if you put if you if you put together the weight of every single bit of candy that has been made by this factory from the beginning of time, babe. Oh, man. Could you imagine? Crazy amounts. Insane amounts. Starch lifter. Ha. Huh. Process wastewater vacuum tank. Oh, you could sit here and watch a little movie, but we are running late, lo, low on time. I mean, we barely got... Oh, look at there's still Jelly Billy, like, little things on this one. Bag sealer. This old bag sealer. Ooh, look at this old car. Okay, there's so much stuff that I... Fairfield, 1986 to 1999. Fairfield, North Chicago, Thailand, 2000 to present. So I didn't realize that they were in Thailand as well. There's so much that it's just hard. Look at that airplane. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Baby's having fun. Okay, so we've got, oh, Aaron. Do you, oh, okay. The 1934 Ford V8 Touring Sedan. 1939 V8 Ford, oh my gosh. How fun, and it's towing a boat. <sighs> okay, you guys, I think that's about it. I'll probably end up doing something a little bit more towards the end. Okay, just a little bit more. Look at this monkey. Oh, isn't he cute? Of course, like a, oh, Chinese New Year rat. That rooster is cool. Puppers, baby boy. Chinese New Year goat, Chinese New Year pig. Oh my gosh, look at these dresses. What the, what? That's crazy. Made with the camera. But babe, do you see these dresses? Holy cow, that's crazy. 
I'm not sure what they do with this. Jelly Belly Motorcycles. Harleys. I think they're Harleys. Maybe they're Indians. Who knows? Oh, that's cool, though. This one would be mine because I could reach the ground. <laughs> oh, look at this one, babe. There's our bike, honey. Okay, we got to get pictures on this. Bad boy. Okay, shirts, more artwork, and then look. I'm going to zoom in as soon as Aaron gets by. <laughs> He's such a dork. Um, a little theatrical performance there. Yeah. <laughs>